Hi, I'm Physics 101, and I've done a number of videos on YouTube, and this is my latest one. It's called Impossible Perpetual Motion. And as you can see, it's a very simple bicycle wheel rotating on its bearings, mounted in polycarbonate, and just effortless going around approximately once every second, seven seconds. Um, I can tell you a little bit about it. Uh, for, for one, it's encased in a polycarbonate case, completely encased. I can take this around and show it to you so you can get a, a little look at it. Uh, here's the side view of it. You can see how the wheel is rotating between uh, those U-shaped structures there. And if I rotate it, and I'll just take it all the way out here and, and show it to you this way, you can see the back is pretty much like the front. Okay, now let me just stick this back here so you can see some of the other structures in it. Uh, you'll notice that there's a, a wheel that's rotating around with the, the actual wheel. This uh, little disc has little contacts on it. You might be able to see those with two probes on either side that are basically almost touching those contacts, not quite. And they're mounted here in the polycarbonate. Now if you rotate down a little bit down to here, you'll see kind of a strange word, word here. It's absorco. And um, it's on this little box that's got lenses on. You saw that before when I turned it sideways. You can see a little lens on there. And there's a lens on the other side too. Okay? Now if you go down here, you'll also see another box about the same size. And this box has four heat sinks on it uh, to reduce heat. And then here, you'll see a copper tube coming up here to this U-shaped structure, and then another one running over here to this U-shaped structure over here. Okay? Now, on, on the wheel itself, on the inner part of the rim, you'll see three equally spaced uh, black cubes that are going around in between those uh, U-shaped structures. Okay? So, uh, and when I show that from the side, you got a good example of that. All right, so... Uh, a couple things to know, as I, I've probably demonstrated already, there are no outside sources of power here. It's, everything is running inside of this for an extremely long period of time. I'm not sure how long this will run. Uh, we just started running this uh, about a week ago, and uh, it's continuously running 24 hours a day. Okay? Uh, not sure how long it will run. I will post it later, finding out how long it will run. So, uh, another thing I will tell you if you're guessing, you, I know this is the rear axle, there is a little space in there. Uh, I, I picked it because I thought it looked cool. But uh, no, there's no motor in this. If you listen very quietly now, as you notice you won't hear any motor running. That's because there's no motor in there. <laughs> the only thing is rotating here is this 16 inch uh, wheel that's rotating at a very constant level. Uh, roughly as I said around seven seconds per revolution. So, uh, also, I've done two other videos you might be interested in. One is called uh, Swing Six Like Iron Man 2. You remember that movie? Uh, the pendulum that sp spun around on Peppa's desk. I built one of those, and I tell you how I built that. So if you're interested in that, you should watch that video. The other one is How to Build a Pinball from Scratch. Now, that's a complicated project. Uh, I'll tell you, it'll probably take you two or three years to build one of those. It has... Uh, a quarter of a mile of wiring, 3,500 parts, 18 microchips, uh, two digital sound systems, eight lighting systems, voiceovers, strobe lights, variable timers, infrared sensors. I could go on and on and on. A really fun project, but a very complicated project. So thanks again for watching this video. It's called Impossible Perpetual Motion, and I hope you like it and uh, vote a positive for it. Thanks again.